Good morning, dear professors, doctors, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Heba Sadeb. I am an assistant professor at the Arab Academy for Science, Technology and Maritime Transport, Alexandria, Egypt. It's really a great opportunity to participate in this online international conference and to have the chance to present my topic, which is about customer brand engagement, impact on brand satisfaction, loyalty and trust in the online context particularly in the Egyptian banking sector. First of all, my presentation will include the following points, introduction, literature review, proposed conceptual framework, research methodology, data analysis and findings, implications, and finally, future directions. And now, let's move to the introduction. Why customer brand engagement? Why I select this topic? As you know, Nowadays, in our competitive business environment, engagement with the brand is becoming very crucial for the long-lasting brand-customer relationship. But what do we mean by customer brand engagement? Customer engagement represents the interaction that takes place between a customer and an organization. And this interaction can reinforce the emotional, physical, and psychological relation the customer has with the organization. For more details, the way in which a brand engages with the customer is through touch points, as you can see here from this figure. These touch points include social media, organizations' websites, and other forms of communication. Particularly, the customer brand engagement becomes more important for the service organizations as service organizations provide intangible products that are hard for customers to realize before purchase. Therefore, it's recommended to engage the customers more and more to boost a wider and more positive brand experience. So customer brand engagement can provide both unique and memorable brand experiences, which will help in developing brand trust, satisfying customers and promoting brand loyalty. And currently, the advancement of the internet and the shift toward digital transformation have contributed to the progress of customer brand engagement and brand experience. So keeping an effective engagement with the customer via frequent online interactions remains a vital issue for developing a unique and creative brand experience, particularly in the service sector. But the question here is, why specifically the Egyptian banking sector? The banking sector in Egypt is one of the oldest and largest in North Africa. It's one of the key pillars of the Egyptian economy since it plays a crucial role in the development process in Egypt. Moreover, the Egyptian banks keep evolving and adapting new technologies because today customers are more influential. Customers can switch from one bank to another if they were not satisfied with the service. And in Egypt, we have 75% of banks offer internet banking services and investing in technology nowadays is the future for the banking sector. And consequently, due to the severe competition and the technological advancement, the Egyptian banks have changed their focus from service-oriented services to customer-oriented ones, which highlighted the need to focus more on customer brand engagement in the online banking context. And now, moving to the literature review, which con uh, consists of uh, the review of the previous, a review of the previous studies concerning the research variables. First, we have the independent variable, customer brand engagement, then the mediator variable, the online brand experience, and then the dependent variables, which consists of brand satisfaction, loyalty, and trust. To make it more clear, let's go to the proposed conceptual framework for the customer brand engagement, which is the independent variable. Uh, here, the customer brand engagement, as mentioned previously in the introduction, it's the regular interaction that takes place between a customer and an organization. And nowadays it has been proven that a customer engagement with a brand is not just a process, but it's a fundamental tool in developing a deeper customer brand relationship. 
And it has been found that customer brand engagement can improve the co-creative experiences, boost customer satisfaction, increase loyalty and trust in the brand. And currently, due to the internet, companies can easily establish an ongoing dialogue with customers that help develop an online experience toward the brand. Particularly in the online banking sector, it has been mentioned that a bank can create a positive and constructive online banking experience by improving the customer brand engagement of the bank's brand. Therefore, we assume the first hypothesis that customer brand engagement has a significant positive direct impact on customers' online brand experience. For the online brand experience, which is a mediator variable, the online brand experience has been described as the customer's personal response to the interaction with the online brand. And the online brand experience has been originated from the idea of customer experience. And based on the previous studies, it has been found that the three main consequences of the online brand experience are brand satisfaction, loyalty, and trust. And it has been found that good brand experience can create an emotional customer bond uh, toward the brand, which will lead to brand satisfaction. Therefore, we assume the second hypothesis, uh, which is uh, the online brand experience has a significant positive direct impact on brand satisfaction. And also, the more a customer feels suitable brand experience, the more possible the customer will repurchase the brand which will lead to brand loyalty. Therefore, we assume the third hypothesis which is online brand experience has a significant positive direct impact on brand loyalty. And finally, it has been mentioned that customers can build their trust toward a brand based on their experience with this brand. Therefore, we can assume the last hypothesis uh, which suggests that online brand experience has a significant positive direct impact on brand trust. And now moving to the research methodology. The research methodology consists of the following main points. A quantitative approach was developed in order to test the research, uh, in order to test the research hypotheses. The sampling technique used in the study was convenience sampling technique, which consists of online banking customers. Electronic questionnaires were uh, uh, used in order to collect data. The collected data uh, were then analyzed by using the structural equation modeling MS22. And now concerning the data analysis and findings. First, a pilot study has been conducted with a total number of 51 bank customers to check the conversion validity and reliability of the questionnaire. And based on the pilot study, it has been found that all methods used to assess the conversion validity showed good values and all indicators have good factor loadings with reliability that exceeds the threshold of 4.6, which is satisfactory for the reliability of scales, as you can see here in this table. Moreover, the average variance extracted for the research constructs show, showed values over 0.5, which is considered adequate for confirming conversion validity based on HER et al. 2010. And now moving to the model fit indices, in order to analyze the hypothesized relationships through the means of structural equation modeling, the goodness of fit of the measurement model should be checked. Therefore, the following model fit indices were conducted before testing the research hypothesis. As you can see from the table, it has been shown here that all model fit indices have been improved after adding the relationships to the model. For example, the CFI of the measurement model was 0.948, and after adding the relationships, it has been found that the CFI has been improved to be uh, 0.961, which indicates an acceptable level of the good fit of the model based on HER et al. 2010. And now, Let's go to testing the testing of the research hypotheses. As you can see from the table, that all the research hypotheses have been supported at 5% significance level. And here in the following uh, table, the AMS output for the model parameter estimates is reflected here. And based on HER et al. 2010, any number of a critical ratio CR over 
1.96 or p-value less than 0.05 is significant in the model. As you can see, again, all the four research hypotheses have been supported. So we can conclude here. As you can see, this is our final research model. So we can uh, conclude that by increasing the level of customer brand engagement, the bank can enhance the degree of satisfaction, build trust, and foster loyalty toward the bank more successfully via uh, creating a unique online uh, brand experience. And now for the implications, this study builds on the body of knowledge by focusing on the crucial role of customer brand engagement in a new context, which is the Egyptian online banking sector. Uh, as you can see for the theoretical implications, the previous studies uh, mentioned that the notion of customer brand engagement is still uncovered. Uh, therefore, uh, we react to the call of the previous studies to develop more research uh, in other sectors and dissimilar cultures to understand more the concept of customer brand engagement by focusing on one of the most crucial sectors that play a crucial role in North Africa which is the Egyptian banking sector. Second, this study tests the main consequences of the online brand experience by combining brand satisfaction, loyalty, and trust. Uh, thus, this study gives more complete pictures than the other previously developed by integrating customer brand engagement, online brand experience, and its main consequences in one research model. As for the practical implications, as you can see, banks need to capitalize on online settings, including their websites and social media. The online brand experience can be enriched through developing user-friendly applications, websites, and other social platforms. And more attention should be devoted to the service providers through developing advanced training programs to improve their skills and capabilities to delight their customers. And finally, managers should consider planning a marketing strategy to participate the customers with the brand. Finally, the future directions. Since this study was conducted in the Egyptian banking sector, future research can test the proposed model in other sectors and other countries as well. Uh, and also, uh, this study only examined the customer brand engagement as an antecedent of online brand experience as well as its consequences. So further research should consider other antecedents of online brand experience, such as brand perceived quality, as well as the antecedents of customer brand engagement, such as brand involvement. Uh, since uh, this study uh, examined customer brand engagement as a single construct, so future research may examine customer brand engagement as a multidimensional construct uh, taking into consideration several dimensions like cognitive, affective, as well as considering the level of customer engagement to better explain why some banks and other sectors are successful in engaging customers than others. And finally, since the study uh, used a convenient sampling technique due to the difficulty of obtaining a sample frame of bank customers, further research needs to use a probability sampling technique to be able to generalize the research findings. Thank you so much for listening.